The Godzilla costume was operated by three individuals in a suit, usually a seven-foot-tall bodybuilder controlling the legs, an average-height man on his shoulders controlling the arms, and a little person on his shoulders controlling the head. Some now famous people who got their humble start in the Godzilla suit include Andre the Giant, David Caruso, Kesha, John Stamos, and Vern Troyer. Over 3,600 iguanas were killed to create the skin for the first Godzilla suit. Godzilla starred in a total of 850 films, nearly all of which have never been released in the United States. Some lesser-known Godzilla films include Godzilla vs. Thor, Godzilla vs. Jesus, Godzilla vs. The Grimace, Godzilla vs. Santa Claus and His Seven Dwarfs, and Godzilla vs. Roe vs. Wade. Godzilla, considered by many film historians to be a metaphor for the United States, at one point drinks an entire Coca-Cola factory in Godzilla vs. Roe vs. Wade. In American releases of Japanese Godzilla films, in addition to dubbing dialogue in English, the eyes of Japanese actors were painstakingly replaced with Caucasian eyes, frame by frame. In the late 1980s, Godzilla starred in a series of fitness videos for children, which stressed the importance of leg day in a well-rounded workout routine. In addition to crushing buildings with his strength and burning people and planes with his atomic breath, Godzilla has also used his nuclear bowel movements to destroy the Imperial Palace of Tokyo in three separate films. Before Matthew Broderick was brought on to star in the disastrous 1998 American Godzilla film, Eric Stoltz played the lead role for two weeks before director Roland Emmerich decided he wasn't right for the role. In an interview with The Hollywood Reporter, Roland Emmerich admitted that he intentionally made the 1998 American Godzilla film terrible because he, quote, hates Japanese culture. In the 1980s, Godzilla co-starred in a short-lived animated series called Ultimate XYZ Power Pals 2099, also featuring Goku, a Gundam mech, Ronald McDonald, and a Japanese interpretation of Popeye the Sailor Man. Scientists in South America are currently trying to genetically engineer a Godzilla-like creature using a combination of dinosaur and frog DNA. Godzilla and his larger-than-life adversaries are known as kaiju in Japan. Kaiju comes from a Japanese derogatory term for obese Caucasian women. Scientists estimate that a real-world Godzilla would weigh as much as the moon and that his tail attack would have more kinetic energy than 50 atomic bombs. Writer Nisei Hito came up with the idea for Mothra while meditating after smoking a bong load of dead moths, a safe, legal, and easy way to get high. In the 1990s, Trojan sold a Godzilla brand of condoms in Asia targeted at men with atomic proportions. They were recalled after two months when they were found to contain dangerous levels of mercury and lead. According to the original Japanese Godzilla legend, Gojira wa Orokadiaru, published in 1877, Godzilla is only able to reproduce homosexually. Mechagodzilla is also gay. 